So today I wanted to bring up how you, the people, the viewers of the media are absolutely being lied to, you know, they have no problem lying to your faces like they are the Prophet Muhammad, I mean, sorry, I mean, sorry, you know, get a little over myself, even though a lot of that text is basically retold Jewish stories, but anyways, we're gonna go, and with the power of editing, we're gonna go and look at the biggest media donors on what is considered to be left wing in the NBC News and CNN spectrum. And then we're going to go to Fox News and all these different right wing sites, okay? Now, so if we look here, we're going to go down and say, oh, we got private insurance. We got, what is it? Medical advice, right? The biggest donors are a lot of different medical companies, right? Got private insurance, progressive private insurance, um, security systems, and I think a lot, and you know, a lot of different mainstream companies, right? Uh, medical products, which I don't even know why we even allow advertising of products that only like only experts really have a grasp on. I know people who study this stuff in like universities for at least eight years in the United States are the ones with all these all like will know what they're talking about here. But instead in America we allow medical like like medical things to be advertised in the literally most fear porn possible context. Where it's, where it's like, uh, where it's like, is a Zempic right for you? And then it's like, and then it's, and then, add, and then you all of a sudden hear someone really fast going like, but it can cause diabetes. It can also lead to a loss of limbs and it can also kill you if you, if you take too much of it. You can also make sure, make sure you take the right dose because it can lead to, to, to scabies virus in all of your veins. It's like, what the fuck are you talking about? Like, yeah, you go from absolutely saying, but it's great for diabetes. It's, it's so stupid. It's just genuinely dumb. But if we continue to scroll down, I, th these are all, you know, all of their sponsors. Crest, which I believe is also owned by, um, by the same parent company that runs, uh, that runs, uh, Col uh, was it Colgate? I believe it's, um, Uh, Gillette, we got all these different things, right? So when, so here's my thing: when you are funded by big pharmaceutical companies, when you're funded by private insurance, which is, by the way, one of the most like scammered and things imaginable, because again, they don't want you to have Medicare. Like in, you know, they don't want you to have that because if you have that, then that's something they have to pay out of pocket via taxes. So they, trust me, they don't want you to have Medicare because the main, th the main hit to their power structure is organized labor. Now, if you go to Fox News' leading advertisers, oh no, what do we have? Progressive again, Liberty Mutual again, JP Morgan Chase, I am sorry. When it, the literal, like, company, one of the biggest company that controls most of the assets, by the way, most of the cash you are able to receive in most countries, I believe in Europe and the United States, that, by the way, in 2008, fucked around with, like, fi like, like, mortgages and made tens of millions of people homeless, like, oh my, like, you're funded by that company. I'm sorry, you don't get to talk shit about people when you're funded by that company, okay? When you're funded by a company that made tens of millions of people homeless. I am sorry, you don't get to advert, you don't get to moralize to me, fucking Rupert Murdoch hacks. Jesus Christ. I honestly, I would rather take them to a tree than a hacksaw. It would be more effective, but holy fuck. But notice how you have Liberty Mutual, Progressive. You got all these companies. You got BlackRock, right? Isn't Fox News like, oh, BlackRock is so dangerous. Oh, no, BlackRock. But then you're, that's one of your biggest advertisers. 
Again, these people have no morals. And I would highly recommend shitting all over them and pointing this out to them. And now we're on CNN's own website where they are funded by Ch Chase Bank, okay? Bank of America, okay? Like I like I said I am sorry anyone who tells me this is like left and right is real needs to watch this video because when CNN who is deemed quote unquote left wing is also funded by the same company that funds Fox News I, you know call it for me to be like maybe it's it's you have the people who are like and this is why, again, this is why they'll talk about really dumb scandals, right? Or it's like, oh, Trump charges 96 documents. Yeah, but have you looked through the documents? You know, like, like you don't talk about any details outside of Trump charge. Or it's Biden's cognitive decline, even though it's clearly an example of primary energy changing from fossil fuels to green energy, you know? And there's a lot of mess that happens with that, but... I digress. And also, again, fuck these mainstream sites. But yeah, this is why I hate the media. This is why I think they are a virus that infects people's brains, makes them stupid, because what? They'll give headline this, and then it's, oh, well, we actually have none of the details available. So sorry, click site. Whoops. Err. Anyways, fuck. These things are more cringeworthy than a Nick Okada avocado video. Holy fuck. Anyways, we're gonna make this video real quick to, to shit all over media. Anyways, peace.